Beautiful dress, perfect makeup, great hair. Sounds like you're ready to take on the world. Wrong. You may look good on the outside, but you're a total mess on the inside. Inside your house, that is. Just ask Claire. I work freelance as a clothing and costume fashion designer. I feel like I've got most things in my life under control. But the one big thing is my room. The way that my room looks right now, it is the worst it has ever been. The biggest problem is definitely my clothes. The floor is almost not walkable. You have to climb over things to get from place to place. The closet is like a big dark cave. I don't know where to start, so I just sort of gave up. I really don't live in my room anymore. I stay at my boyfriend's house because there is nowhere for me to sleep in my bedroom. When I look at that room, I feel a lot of anxiety. It gives me so much stress that I don't want to live with any longer. Hi! How are you doing? Come on in. I'm Justin. Nice to meet you. I'm Claire. Tell me why I'm here. You are here because my bedroom is really bad. <laughs> really, like really bad. It is really, really bad. Uh, all right, so this is the bedroom. I see tons of clothes. A I lot of clothes. I see a lot of shoes. Um, I think just at this point, it's about us making some decisions to just really get this going. Yeah. So we're going to tackle this with a team, with your mindset of what you want, and find some space for you to breathe in here again. Okay. Would that be a good thing? That would be fantastic. Justin faced quite a challenge, so we sent him back to work his magic. Hi. Good morning. Come on in. I'm going to have you with me and a team. The stuff that you're going to want to keep, we're going to set aside. The stuff that's going to go, it's going to go into a bag, never to be seen again. That sounds wonderful. Computer? Computer can go. The monitor can go, too. What up? This chair you said could go, yeah? That can go. Gone. Can you start grabbing every pair of shoes? and let's bring them out there okay. and start lining them up. Everything that's on the bed at this point should probably just be washed because it's had, it's had cats laying on it. I'm starting to see a floor. I got some more jewelry for you, but these are broken. But I could totally fix them. When do you have the time to fix them? Probably never. <laughs> so I want you to be realistic about things like that going forward in your life completely because there's always gonna be something that you can do. The question is, is it worth your time to do it? Yeah. I've been doing this for a long time. First time I've <laughs> ever come across a bulletproof vest. Look, we found some more shoes. The donation guys are here to take all the clothing, all the jewelry that she's donating, the bed frame, the dresser, the nightstand, and the bookshelves. We're gonna let you go for about four and a half, five hours. We're gonna do what we do best, which is implement, organize, create discipline. And that way when you get back, I, I will teach you how to keep things up so it doesn't ever get like that please, again. Please, please, <laughs> please, please. We have some new furniture for her that Ikea supplied to us. A new dresser, a new bed frame, new place for storage. Now we're gonna start dressing the space, putting her stuff back in, and see you in a minute. You ready to see a room? I'm ready. Keep coming. Okay. Keep coming. Open your eyes. <laughs> it's just, it looks so big. Can I like test it out? It's your bed. Do whatever you want. <laughs> it's really comfortable. Wow. 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 Look at all my shoes. There's so much room in here. So much room. This is amazing. Thank you so much. <laughs>